never friends with these boxes. It's always a trouble trying to open them. But new box, new video, let's go. Um I think well I have my scissors right here. So I'm just gonna use that. I'm not gonna try to like so this is what I mean though. like look how long it's actually been to cut the box. Just just let's let's do that rapidly. Okay, that took some manpower. But it's another photography related video. And obviously you could tell from the title of the video. But here we have a new Fuji lens, right? Fujinon XC 35mm f2. I wonder why is it Fuji? Is it Fujinon? Am I saying that correctly? If there's any other Fuji shooters that know a bit more about the camera brand, please please let me know why is it Fujinon and not just Fujifilm. But anyways, new lens and I'm actually very excited for this because I've been using my kit lens which is the what's that 15 to 45 millimeter f 3.5 to 5.6 so if you know about photography the f stop normally talks about the focal length so how much of the image is in focus and how much of the background is blurred out I needed a new lens to get more of the more of that bokeh as they would say where the background is completely blurred out so this video is an unboxing of that lens um, I might try to take some images nothing too like modelly but just some basic images to show you guys sample of the lens right so it comes with normal paperwork right and it comes with a user manual. Don't know why I need a, a user manual for a lens. But if you don't know how to use a lens, it comes with a manual. I bought this from John Lewis here in the UK. It was the only place that was selling it for the cheapest, I would say, brand new. 169. I was looking on used lenses and used it was like 199, 169. Um but then I try I was trying to sell like no, wrong, sorry. I watched a video and I saw someone saying that it retailed, it retailed for like 179 And I'm like, wait, so why am I going to pay 199 Did the lens price go up? I must can find it for like an appropriate price for today. And looked everywhere, ordered one first, and it was saying not yet available, we'll let you know. So like I emailed them saying cancel my order basically. And I continued looking and, continued looking and I found John Lewis. So, big up, John Lewis, the company. <laughs> and found the, found the lens, and now I have it. It's a really tiny lens. They have a XC35. Um, I, think, I think it's like F2 also, but a metal body one. This, well, that would be XF, if I'm correct. This one is the plastic version, the cheaper product cheaper little brother I would say but for me it's just as perfect honestly wow this is actually a nice looking small lens you can see like I think it's gonna be focused on me still but yeah there we go it's like tiny on the inside it's literally like so tiny I think my other lens is like maybe like that yeah because Fuji such a compact cameras like they make such compact cameras and the lenses are actually tiny when you put them on this is actually a tiny lens yeah you know what i'll do i will switch over to that lens on the camera and then you'll see as i said this is 35 millimeter i think right now i'm shooting all the way wide maybe 18 if i'm not on 18 i'm at like 20 something maybe but 35 is not too close which is what i love like normally when i had my canon body it was 50 millimeter 50 is 
it's pretty close to be honest I'm not going to lie like if I'm supposed to zoom this all the way in to what was it 45 yeah let's let's zoom all the way in. like sorry for you seeing all that but this this is 45 this is 45 you can't yeah this is 45 50 would be closer right and 50 was what was on my canon and now this is i think it was 18 to 50 but this goes wider at 15 to 45 this is now 35 and you can see when it's all the way at 45 my background is still not completely blurred out but is a bit blurred out since i'm getting the face recognition is focusing on my face but it's not completely blurred out with this it should have a lot more blur so that's 45 let's fix this because i'm not leaning all the way back on my chair i'm just sit up right i'm not here you can't see shit so i think i was like there yeah and that's not even all the way wide either so yeah but let's switch the lens and come back so here i'm using now get focus on my face i'm not using the 35 so you can see i'm all the way back and it's not as close but is this oh this is this isn't even like all the way open it's at f5 right now i'm gonna push it to f2 then you're gonna see but i think this is like a sharper it should should be a bit sharper i'll look back and see but you guys can let me know also this lens is supposed to be a sharper lens so let's push it to f Two. Two. Yeah, can I get my face to be focused? There we go. Let me lean back again. F2. Maybe I need to get this up a bit. Get this focused on me a bit more. And if I'm like there in focus, what? Can we? Whoa! I'm sure we can see like behind me is a bit blurred compared to the previous lens. I don't think as much is in focus. Let's see if I can. My hand, I can't really do my hand properly. Let's see the scissors. Scissors is actually like that. It's out of focus compared to the other one. So this is F2. If I'm supposed to bump it back where the other lens was, other lens was F5 get it to focus a bit and if you put the lens if you put the, the scissors back here you can see it so that's what it means by focal length and bokeh and all that stuff all right so if i go all the way back to f2 like that it's blurry you get me so that's basically what this lens can now do and it should now take my photos to the next level when I'm looking to take some nice headshot portraits. But obviously, for you two, I may most likely still use, oh, I sh should have closed the lens, but I most likely still will use my 15 to 45 because I don't want it to be this close, if you get me. I do like a bit wider when I'm shooting my YouTube videos, unless it's like a headshot with me just talking, wanting to see more, I'm gonna most likely use this lens. But yeah. That's really it for the unboxing. Thank you so much for watching. Obviously, if you like the video, leave a like and subscribe if you're new. Or if you've been watching but you haven't subscribed as yet, make sure to check it out you're subscribed and subscribe. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Trey and this actually ends the video of my Fujifilm XC35 F2 unboxing. Bye-bye.